Let's have a conversation about how to sell on YouTube step by step. Welcome back, folks, to another edition of the Awesome Sweetie Kiwi Show. How are you today? I hope you are doing fantastic. I'm doing marvelous, if you ought to ask me. If you are doing as great as I am, go grab a cup of coffee, or tea, or vodka, and let's roll. <laughs> In today's conversation, I want to explain to you how to sell on YouTube step by step. First, let's talk about the overview. So when we think about YouTube, we are thinking about 1 billion hours. That's basically the amount of time people spend watching videos on YouTube every single day. Think about it, 1 billion hours every single day. That's just humongous, okay? And basically, YouTube is uh, the second most popular social network in the world after Facebook, and but it is the second search engine in the world after Google. And think about it, both Google and YouTube are owned by Alphabet. So this is just fantastic, okay? So when we talk about YouTube marketing, selling on YouTube, who can benefit from it? Well, everybody, businesses, entrepreneurs, content creators organizations and whatnot totally d d depends on you okay so in terms of uh, youtube marketing you are talking about promoting your business or products on youtube's platform okay and you can actually upload valuable videos on your company's uh, youtube channel or using youtube ads so those are the two conduits that you can use to actually sell on youtube you can actually uh, have a youtube channel and you up you know you can actually upload a lot of videos there make sure the videos are good though i mean you know nobody wants to, to see some crappy uh, videos or whatever so you want to have a, a valuable video or you can actually place ads so those are the two conduits now the truth about uh, youtube marketing is that it is a great opportunity, but a lot of people right now don't don't know it. It, it is really untapped because uh, as everybody is, mo is moving through mobile shopping, right? We have online shopping. Amazon is doing great. Walmart is kicking ass. We have a lot of players in the field. YouTube, YouTube can play a bigger role because the customers right away, they actually uh, use videos to make a purchase decision. Okay, it's really important. They use the, the video content to purchase, to help them purchase a good or service. So this is really great. You can actually see that. So overall, what I want, what I want you to get from this part is that if you want to sell on YouTube, you have to decide: Do I want to be, do I want to be on the platform itself? Do I want to have a, a YouTube channel, or I just want to place ads that are targeted to uh, my, you know, to my uh, prospects? Let's talk about the essentials. There are a few things you need to understand if you want to succeed on um, on the platform. So what do you need to sell on YouTube? If you want to sell on YouTube, whether a product or a service, there are a few fundamentals you need you need to have, okay? Basically, you gotta have good content. <laughs> you know, that's just basic. You gotta have good content. You gotta have captivating uh, content that people want to watch. In other words, you have to solve a solution. You have to provide a solution. You have to solve a pain point. Okay, what is that thing that you are doing that actually uh, helps can help people? Okay, but besides all those all those basic elements, you need to have a video recording setup. I'm not talking about people telling you, hey, you know, you can record from your cell phone, whatever. You can record from your cell phone if you want to open just a YouTube channel and trying to grow your audience. In other words, let's say you are a hustler, you are an entrepreneur, and you just want to know. But if you want, if you have a business and you want to sell on YouTube, it's really important to think of it as a business. So you need to invest in a video recording setup. I'm talking about a camera, a microphone, a tripod, lighting, video editing software to have a to have some nice backdrop too. Those are important. Okay, you need to have a website or landing page. Now, what I'm trying to say here is that. YouTube itself does not help you make sales. In other words, I mean, they do have uh, possibilities in terms of uh, your online shop. You can do something something called print on demand. So you sell t-shirts, you sell some garments and whatnot. That's totally possible. But the, the juice really is in having a website or landing page. In other words, you want to redirect 
your your followers from YouTube onto your landing page. You know, that's kind of cool because on the on the landing page or the website, you own everything that, everything that happens there. Everybody knows that on YouTube, sometimes they have policies, they have directives, whatever they do. Because hey, listen, this is their platform. They're trying to protect it, right? And you want to be able to be also have a platform that you own and protect. So that's why you want to actually tell your flock to uh, go on your uh, your landing page there and make money and actually convert okay and the third thing you need to have is you need to have a willingness to help i said it earlier you got to provide valuable content value adding content you need to solve a pain point don't you just walk around and just post in random videos you got to be specific in terms of the service in terms of the, in terms of the niche you address very important okay very very important you need to uh do you need to provide value <music> Let me talk to you now about the video creation. So this is important that when we talk about selling on YouTube, you got to have a video creation, especially if you want to go uh, the YouTube channel route, right? Even if you want to do that, if you want to just post the ads on YouTube, you got to understand how videos are created or, I mean, you can, don't get me wrong though. I'm not sitting here telling you that you can do the, the thing yourself. But you can even outsource the whole thing to uh, an agency. But the thing is, it's good to have uh, to have a clear understanding of how it works. Okay, remember that the process of selling on YouTube actually has three steps: you create videos, you get traffic, and you promote your channel. And promote your channel, also your company or the service or the product you're selling by redirecting people onto your website or landing page. Okay, so the first process, the first step is uh, creating videos. So you got to answer common questions. You got to do SEO research, okay? Trying to find out exactly what uh, what people are looking for. It's not about what you want to share with the world. It's about what people are looking for, okay? Remember what I told you earlier. You need to solve a pain point. You need to solve a very important, a critical, a critical. Uh, I think uh, you know a problem for folks, okay? So you need you can show, for example, the the manufacturing process, the brainstorming process in your company. You can create topical content for your industry. Okay, again, you have to be uh, you have to be uh, trendy. It has to be captivating. You can share reviews made by others. This is totally possible. Yeah, totally possible. Okay, there are some copyright issues here, but uh, as long as you share reviews and you give the person credit, you are good to go. And you you can also engage your your audience with YouTube Shorts. In case you're not familiar with uh, this thing, um, YouTube Shorts allows you to. Uh, those those are less than 60 seconds videos where you can just do a lot of stuff okay you don't have to spend uh, 500 dollars on a on a normal youtube uh, video like eight minutes or more you can actually just have a shorts okay and uh, you can shoot a comedy that relates to your product or service you know any content that can be distilled into a few quick steps or data points you can share a simple tips and life hacks so the goal is yours here okay and you can also share updates on YouTube in YouTube stories, actually. Okay, so YouTube Shorts is not the only short form content on YouTube. There are also YouTube stories, okay? So these are a collection of short videos that users can watch on their mobile app. Let me talk to you about traffic routing, and this is so important. I mean, you know, the thing is, if you want to sell profitably on YouTube, you have to redirect traffic. Very important. You need to get traffic to your site. We're talking about a landing page or your website. Okay. So how do you do these things? Well, first of all, you need to understand that there, you need to understand why we are saying this. Remember, YouTube owns their platform. They can change things on a whim. They can actually modify things. They can come up with new policies and terms and conditions. And if you build your business model around something you don't own, this is uh, quintessentially a mistake. Okay. This is why you need to have an outside store, website, landing page and whatnot, whatever it is to be able to reroute the, the traffic there. And you can do this by adding links to your video descriptions. Oh, yeah, this is really good. I mean, you know, basically, you got to really uh, write great descriptions. OK, that's that's definitely important. But you want to add links there because uh, viewers will read your descriptions. And if, if you have uh, 
interesting links for them they will click on those links and uh, they, they will go to whatever website you want to redirect them to okay use interactive cards so cards are really uh, interactive uh, elements that you can insert into a video to do different things you can show off your products or websites or link to another video okay and the cool thing is that you uh, you have an opportunity here to sell more to your viewers okay not sell but let's just say add value because it's all about adding value first if you can add real value people will buy from you okay and uh, so if you check out Google's half section to learn about how to use cars actually okay so you can link cars to uh, an external website you can link cars to uh, your YouTube channel okay you can actually have a playlist at the end of the at the end of uh, a video totally possible you can also think about adding end screens okay so end screens are overlays that sit at the end of your YouTube video and encourage your viewers to take action after they watch your video okay so end screens can be added to the last 5 to 20 seconds of a video they are often recorded to promote other videos on your channel or encourage viewers to subscribe okay so as an online seller you can use end screens to direct people to your online store of product pages so this is totally uh, possible Let me talk to you now about video marketing. Okay, we are still talking about how to sell on YouTube, right? It's very important. And so, how do you actually market your YouTube videos? Well, there are a lot. Of, there's a, there are a lot of ways you can do that. Okay, because think about it. Once you have made your videos and uploaded them to YouTube, it's time to promote your channel. I mean, you know, YouTube has uh, gazillions of uh, channels and videos every single day or every every single hour. So just don't believe that you can just upload things and just uh, start receiving traffic unless you have you already have uh, the the subs needed. Okay, you have a, a consequential number of subs. Okay, so if you don't right now, what you want to do is you got to think about a constellation of things, a variety of things to draw the traffic and and market your uh, your your videos and promote your videos. First, engage with the community okay YouTube comments can often be a great source of viewers okay and uh, so you want to engage with your community and answer questions this is really good people viewers will take you seriously if you answer their questions okay you can also do a community uh, you can do polls you can post the stuff in the community okay you, you can you can do uh, surveys okay you can ask questions whatever anything you can do to actually engage with your audience with your viewers this is really good go ahead and do it okay and invest in YouTube SEO it's, this is important I mean you just don't want to walk around and just to make videos randomly what's up with that no no you gotta be serious again we're not talking here about random YouTube uh, creators taking their cell phone and just um, posting whatever no if you want to sell if you want to you have to treat this as a business okay so you want to make videos on video keywords okay so those are keywords that have a large number of video results in Google at least two or three and those videos lead to more sales okay you can use uh, SEO optimized descriptions okay you can actually uh, look at uh, your competitors uh, videos to see what they do you want to promote outside YouTube also this is important okay you can actually promote within YouTube okay we're talking about actually uh, running ads okay and you can yeah so you can run YouTube ads also and but you can also promote within YouTube without running ads though so a lot of ways you can comment on other people's uh, channels you can uh, you can actually engage uh, via other means it's totally up to you and the bottom line is you have to do things honestly and consistently those are two elements that will help you and have a great video marketing strategy in the long run. I'll be right back right after this. Don't go anywhere. Welcome back, folks, to another edition of the Awesome Studio Kiwi Show. We are also talking about how to sell on YouTube, and I want to talk to you about viewer engagement. I spoke briefly about that before, but uh, I really want to dig a little deeper here. And the reason is that if you want to actually sell consistently and permanently 
on YouTube and you want to do this over a long time, you need to engage the viewers because the viewer is actually uh, the king or queen for that matter. Okay, they are the one actually uh, making the, the buying decision. So you want to take the initiative to engage first. Okay, people are thinking, well, you know what? I just post a video and people just comment. No, sometimes it's great to just uh, start asking questions, or whatever, and uh, and it's always you can have a question in your description, uh, your your description to, or have a question in your um, you can have a question as a survey question. Okay, always reply to comments. I've said this before. You need to reply to comments. People love it. Viewers love it when you reply to comments. At least when you reply to comments as fast as possible i'm not asking you to reply to comments after one week or one month not at all no you want to you want to uh, actually uh, reply to comments this is very important and you also want to engage on their turf your viewers actually have uh, questions and you want to let them ask the questions you want to ask them ask the kind of question the, the kind of topics they want so you actually uh, use your viewers as a source of intel to know what videos to produce okay feature the conversation so if you if there is a great conversation going on on your youtube channel you want to feature that conversation viewers love it okay you want to engage off youtube okay so if you you can actually engage you know, with your your viewers on other platforms on your website okay you can engage your viewers also on uh, on facebook for instance on instagram okay and uh, you want to thank people for sharing this is important and one thing we have done our, in, on our show is to ask them something, to ask your viewers something, okay? You can give them a question to answer, something in the video that evokes some sort of thoughts, okay? Don't always ask questions that benefit you, the creator. Sometimes you should actually ask questions that benefit the viewer. Very important, okay? You want to ask questions that benefit the community. You want to engage, you want to actually encourage the community to interact, Okay, and one thing we have seen that works for us and other channels is that you want to offer more value and engagement than you ask for in return. Okay, so when you ask a lot of values, you're going to grow on this channel. You're going to be able to sell extraordinarily on this channel. Let me talk to you about outsourcing. Obviously, you can do the things yourself, right? You can actually do a YouTube channel yourself and all, all that kind of stuff. But some people don't have time. I mean, actually, it's a lot of work. I mean, you know, speaking from experience, it's a lot of work. You know, our team is just, uh, they're busting their asses every single day to produce content. It is a full-time job and uh, it is a lot of work. So if you don't have the time to do it, then you can outsource the whole thing to, uh, to uh, YouTube marketing agencies. Okay, And we have actually uh, collected a few of them that you might want to try. So we have social in, socially in. First one is so socially in. It is a Birmingham based social media agency that helps brands across various industries with uh, different social media marketing strategies. Okay. And so the, the agency splits its services into four main categories. So you have creative and production, community management, social media strategy, and social paid advertising. Another uh, player, you have Thrive Internet Marketing Agency. Okay, this is another great player here. They actually describe themselves as a full service, results driven digital marketing agency. You have Moburst. Okay, this is another uh, agency that does a lot, that actually does a lot of work in terms of YouTube sales and YouTube growth. Okay, you have Life Marketing. And Life Marketing does a lot of stuff for YouTube uh, promotion. They do a social media management services. They do social media advertising services. So besides, so beyond YouTube, they also uh, cover other social media, okay? They do search engine services, PPC management services, website and graphic design services. So they offer uh, a lot more, uh, I would say a lot more services. You have Vario Video or, yeah, Vario Video or Vario Video. It is actually a video marketing agency that actually uh, designs and executes video campaigns from start to success, okay? You also have Barracuda. So Barracuda is kind of cool because they are based in London, but they kick ass like crazy. They kick ass, really wonderful. And we love them. They do YouTube uh, promotion, YouTube advertising also, okay? And uh, you have Factor One, another great uh, company that you want to think about if you are interested in growing your YouTube follower base and you want to make money on YouTube. 
you have marketing high which is another great uh, platform also that does youtube uh, promotion youtube ads video optimization video ranking youtube retargeting and brand videos and so on and so forth okay you also have a marketing marketing agency another great player here they do a lot of stuff also and you also have a veritone one so veritone one also helps with youtube a growth youtube sales strategy and the last but not the least we have void media and they also do a lot of stuff they actually they are a full service agency that offers everything from youtube marketing to facebook marketing to instagram marketing and so on and so forth so this is a great Thank you so much for your attention, folks. I really appreciate it. I was talking to you today about how to sell on YouTube, and I talked about, I'll give you the overview. I spoke to you about the essentials, the video creation process, the traffic routing, the video marketing, the viewer engagement, and the outsourcing. Thank you so much for your attention. God bless you. I will speak to you another time. But until then, remember, stay marvelous.